Hey, you guys. Um, <clears throat> oh, see, uh, oh, why did I do that? Why did I start that with um? Okay, I'm a hot mess this morning. I know I'm a hot mess. My thumbnail, I was trying to get things, had my this in my mouth, but that's okay too. Okay, let me. It is time for Bible study. Well, it will be in a few minutes, so I thought I would throw some. So um, I thought I would throw some. First, so I have I to. I would throw some. First, I would throw some. First. There. Oh my gosh, was that not annoying? Hi, Adam. So you're going to hang with me for just a few minutes? I really. Um, or, there's that word again. Okay. So, Adam, I don't know if you're watching anything. Hey, Vanessa. Vanessa has. And, yes, like I said, I look like a hot mess. Uh, my thumbnail. Yes, I have my paintbrush. Okay, you guys. So, the other day, you know, I, I think I showed this when my daughter gave me. It was this key, this box it says love is a master key that opens the gates of happiness well it was black and uh, thank you Vanessa you always say that so it was black shiny black and you know I wanted to put it up in here but as you guys can see it, it was too perfect so I had a crackle paint left over and I promise you guys I am not going to crackle paint everything. I promise my my puppy's nose, Bailey's nose will not end up crackled. I promise that. But I did keep looking at this, and I did not want the shiny black. So I did that. And what I'm going to be doing today, um, I really am going to try not show my butt. And I've got to do this kind of fast because. Casey will be having Bible study in a minute, hot minute. So that shelf up there, it had white brackets. And the more that I looked at it, and then I was going to hang the key up there. Oh, thank you, Vanessa. Oh, you guys, I'm having a day. Yesterday, I had a headache all day. I mean, I tried to stick with Todd last night on his on his channel. I wish he would have made the entire mark. So this is what I'm doing. This is gray. Right there. That's, that's gray. I'm going to make a mess. Morning, baby. So, yes, I'm going to make a mess. Now, okay, let me think. Forever Luzon is Tara. Did I get that right this time? Is it Tara? Uh. You know, Casey had it the other day, and I really thought mine was related to uh, pollen because my baby puppy wants to go outside every five minutes, and the pollen's awful. You guys are with me on this because you know what? I don't know how this can turn out. I did take the the uh blue that came from that's what I painted the back of the walls with and they're that way for a reason because nothing in my room and if Adam you go back to see some of uh, what my room looks like nothing is supposed to be perfect in here because it's artistic you know it's just me and I'm not perfect <sighs> can you believe that don't shh, don't tell Dwayne I'm not perfect because he thinks I am so I painted those ugly white um, shelf brackets up there. I painted them blue, but, you know, I don't want it to stay that blue. And I know I have a glare on my mirror. I mean, on my mat. I tried to cover that up. Anybody that knows that you are not supposed to spray some stuff inside, I know better. But... I really tried to take the shine off of that map. So I had this grand idea to use my Mod Podge spray, flat 
indoors. Hey, my honey bunny. Yeah, she's my vibe. So, of it, and I almost probably killed all of us in this house. Oh, Casey will tell you. Oh, it was. It was so. Oh, the smell was awful. It was chemically. It, see, I'm getting paint on my blue jeans, which that goes right with it. Okay, you guys, let me uh, throw some while you guys are talking about yourself. I'm going to make a mess. Yes, I'm just going to, I'm going to make a mess of that black shelf up there. And like I said, you guys going to get a wide load. Hi, Tracy. I will keep you in my prayers because yesterday I was in pain. Today I can't hardly breathe. I know you guys can't tell by listening to me, but um, I hate having to uh, do my albuterol, but I had to, I had to do something this morning. So you guys don't get to see me make a mess. So one moment. Let me make sure my butt's not taking up the space. I have this on a rolly cart. Okay. And I guess the lighting's good enough. So, you know, I'm just going to have fun with it because, you know, nothing's supposed to be. Oh, wait. I can do the, um, what's his name? I can do the voice of, oh, my, my painter I love, Bob Ross. Okay, I think we're going to put a smoke screen up on here. Do you guys think it needs a smoke screen? I do. And you guys, there's my angel right here. I love her. My daughter left her out by the pool, and that she's an outside. She is for outside, and she started corroding. Oh man. Did she look pretty? She looks so pretty that way. So I brought her in and I'm like, I am going to make me a, I'm going to make me a something ship, pirate, maps, whatever. And she's going to be part of it. I found her in the bottom of the ocean, you guys. Not really, but, you know, that's my imagination. And this this room is my imagination. You know, Casey is great because he knows how his mom's mind works. So, you know, Adam, I don't know what you thought, like, when I start showing up on these things. My mind's crazy. Yeah. It's a, uh, um, just a crazy mashup of different stuff. And I try to get it all out before Keevan gets home, my husband. So he doesn't have to put, put up with it. I know she's not in there crying. Bailey. Last night I had to put a gel mask on, on the back of my neck. To get some relief. Um, Gina. I don't know. I bought this to paint. What did I buy this for? But it was in a gallon. And what I did was. All these containers. Like this. I started adding the extra paint to. And then uh, kills. I did the same with kills. Um, and I have not forgot about my, my painting, and I'm, I'm not ready for that yet, but I do have the idea, and it's going to happen in its time, which won't be much longer. Can you guys hear me okay as I'm doing, as I'm doing this? Um... What normal is either because if somebody it says they are completely normal 
Ooh. They have some of these hanging out in their closet. Do you know? They really have some of these. If they say they're perfect, then guess what? They have a whole lot of these going on. And that's my story. And you know what? He's going to watch me from right here. My little skeleton man's going to be sitting right there. So, that's what I'm talking about on there. So, on the blue, on this blue, I'm going to add some antique white. See there? And make a mess with it. And, you know, I'll be working on my jars. I say here yesterday as I listened to Ch uh, Todd's channel. And and I sit there and I just worked on, you know, separating colors. And until my back hurt, but all right, that's my mess, and I'm gonna clean it. And what I'm going to do is show you guys. Oh, you have to be here with the aches and pains as well. All right, let me get me some tea. My mouth's dry. Okay, there's my, there's that. Love you, Tracy. All right. That mirror, right back there, it was a mirror. Once upon a time, it was a mirror. But, ooh. Let me see. No. Okay. Once upon a time, it was a, somebody's mirror, and it was on the side of the road. Oh, that hurt my shoulder, you guys. I go to the doctor today. So, I put it in the car and had to get it out before Casey saw it, because I'm like, well, if he sees that in his car, and I kept it for a long time, and, it, you know, it was like, what? Are, what is that for? I said, I know what it's for, you know. My husband would walk through this middle room, and oh, you have to go back to day one, which was as bad as it got. And I'd be like, I know what it's for. I know what the crack mirror's for. The crack mirror, you know, the turn slow. The crack mirror. I knew what I wanted that for. I did not let nobody throw that sucker away. It stayed on the back deck. I don't know how long. And I tell them to leave it alone. And and that I had something for it. So I finally got to, you know, Casey, bless him. He, uh, you know, arranged things. And I had him one way. But Casey, one morning, I woke up and he said, yeah, your desk will fit there. So glad that he's got it this way. And so I painted it. I think I already had it painted flat black. What I had planned on in the center of it was to. Are you seeing it? Are you see? Can anybody see it? Um, yeah, I, I'm on my laptop. So, anyway, I had the image in my head. I, I was going to do these different masks because I'll have to show that in another 
thing because I do have some different masks that I had poured up and they're different types of faces and I was going to have them coming out of a broken mirror. Uh, you know, Adam, I don't believe it. You know, somebody threw it out on the side road. Maybe they had bad luck, but I just picked it up. <laughs> so I ain't worried about it. It's pretty. It's pretty. So this one, instead of doing the faces coming out of the wall, in which I might still do that, I put the crackle paint and the center of it. Let me see if I can get closer show you what Casey picked me up at a he picked up for me. I did put this in the let me see if I can find. Let me. All right. He got me the three jars and that rack. The jewelry up there. Oh, you guys, I love that. That came from throwaway jewelry. And so what else? Oh, uh, you know, yes, you have to think. Uh, hey, I'm broken. I mean, I've been broken for a long time, but. Yeah, isn't that piece real pretty, though, uh, Kimmy? And I like it up there, you know, because it kind of looks like something a uh, treasure ship would end up having. Yes, Adam. I, I really have to curb in my picking stuff up, stuff up off the side of the road. And, but a lot of this stuff was was uh, castaways. Except, like I, I explained in one video, Adam, this uh, this lantern is probably about 115 years old. And I just, I hung jewelry off of it. And, you know, I like old stuff. And so I'm throwing stuff in that I can see it every day. Hey, Lynn B. Oh, yeah. You guys, I'm back to having the paint on me. It makes me happy. For anybody watching, I'll just tell you. My happy place, and that's why Casey got in here. And finally, hi, Sissy. Aw, hey, girl, I'm all stories. But, you know, I had to have a, something to occupy my mind. And so when all the jewelry exploded, it had to go somewhere. And I really had ideas swirling through my head but they were just there you know in here so you know yesterday I kind of had to take it easy even though it wasn't easy on my back to sit there like I did last night but you know I went through some of the jewelry and got out these Starbucks jars and started separating oh this is a honey jar let me tell you about my son he has started making me throw away my Starbucks jars. But when I use the rest of this honey, this is what Casey said. And Gina, don't have a stroke because you got to show up for Bible study. Casey said, um, be sure to save that, Mom. You can use that. I said, what? He said, the jar. I said, oh. Oh. So you want me to save the jar? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, it is neat, but okay. You guys? Now, there's some things he says throw away, and I'm like, well, I don't know, but yes, we throw it away. But for him to tell me to keep the honey jar, oh, goodness. I thought that was funny because, oh, I'll show you guys this. I don't know if I showed it yet on on um cam. But when people ask for prayer for their pets, it, you know, they go here. 
uh, when my when my Bailey my Briley got killed as a mailman, true story, ran over her and really hurt my heart. I had the still had her collar because she didn't like it. And so I hung it on a jar in case I said, Mom, why don't you make it a prayer jar, you know, for people? Because everybody asks for prayers for their, their, um, not yet, Vanessa. Oh, so anyway, anytime somebody asks for prayers, I bring them and put them in the jar. So. Vanessa, that's one reason I got in here and started getting some stuff off my desk and have a place that I can put up my easel. I really don't like doing easels because I'm one to either I used to do murals on walls or things flat. But I want a big I've got to find my biggest easel. But I will tell you, Eva, this is what I got in mind. It's going to start out with the gray canvas. You know, kind of like what you see up there. It's going to be black and gray and, you know, it's going to seem, oh, no, that's sad. You know, don't start with the sad color. And I'll build up from that. And to do a self-portrait as far as now, I have to go through some pictures of myself. I've never done it. And number two, I, I'm going to get my, little, uh, my granddaughter to pose for me how I have in my mind of me under the dresser. Adam, she had to go to the doctor yesterday. She um, had to get some cast on her leg to stop them from swelling. But other than that, she hung out with Sandy last night. So she does pretty good if she feels like hang, hanging out with Sandy. Um, so I don't know what time that chick went to bed last night. But never know what Mama's doing, Adam. You just have to. Uh, we're going to have to get her on Facebook whenever. Oh, wow. Um, she has one, two, three, four, five. She has about six. She has about six uh, dream catchers already made. I want to do this without. Okay. You're going to see uh, bright light because this is the morning. The. Uh, Light is not even on in here. That is the morning sun coming in. Oh, my window. And there's there's my jars that, you know, that I've still got to separate and go through. And that right here is my sunken treasure. But let me see if it's going to show without the light on. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I see it's focusing up there. Is Mama's dream catcher? So let me cut the light on. Just some of them, you guys. Yes. So you guys see that? Mama's dream catchers, aren't they pretty? Look at the uh, colors. And now the one on the far left, the blue feathers, that's my grandson's. And she has a lot more uh, to do. And the, I love the second one with the burgundy feathers. Oh, I love them all. And they look really pretty up there, but that's not where they're going to stay because she doesn't sell them. So back around. Um, yeah, she, and she still, yes, my mom's night owl. She worked third shift for so many years that she doesn't sleep at night. Oh, did one of them have a butterfly? Did they help Vanessa? And Adam, you will be seeing them because I think in the next 
uh, auction. What is it, girl? You better not be getting into stuff. In the next MSP auction, those will be going up for auction. And they have uh, real deer antlers. And there is a big bag of deer antlers um, that's there. Oh, the door? Let me see. That was my idea. Because I wanted to bring more light in here from the morning and make it look bigger. And I did this when the it was all still a big mess. All right. There we go. So I took a mirror that used to be from my daycare for my daycare kids. You know, the kind that if it cracks, it's not going to hurt anything. And I put it up there that way. And then I stuck the butterflies to kind of bring the color over to what my sister said was the dull green color or too dark. And we've kind of fancied it up some. Uh-oh. Okay, Casey. I'm not going to be late. I'll wrap it up. Yes, I did see the uh, dove. And I think Sandy's going to start doing some of the doves that way. But... My husband came in because I could I couldn't um I couldn't get him to put that there. So one day I did what Casey got on to me about. One chair, another chair, and then a higher chair. And I was up there and he comes through the kitchen and he says, What are you doing? And I'm like a kid. And I lean down and look at him. And I said, nothing. And I get in trouble. You know, the roles have turned. It starts in at 11 o'clock, Kimmy. It starts in a few minutes. So, yeah, I've got to wrap it up. But anyway, Casey came in there and he helped me down. And that was before my shoulder surgery. But I am, I'm not supposed to do that because I have a, I can just pass out or my legs just go numb. So he's right. So, you know what? Hey, uh, Leticia, the notifications are crazy. That's why this morning I looked to see if anybody was on before I did this. And I guess I'll wrap it up. I, you know, I was told by people, you know, you got to do it. You got to do it. You know, and he, and uh, I've had a lot of you to, you know, push me and tell me what, you know, explain what this is all about. So anyway, I'm about to go in there in Casey's domain and I'm going to church. I have pain on me, but I'm going to church, you guys. And I love you. Thank you for tuning in. And Adam, thank you for stopping by. Thank you. And anytime that you see me live, just stop in. I don't, I'm, I'm winging it. I don't know what to say. Um, I just, I just am me. All right, Kimmy, Kimmy, and all of you guys. I love you guys. Sucked into the crawly vortex, you guys. I'm sorry you're here now. There's no getting out. So, okay. Ending the stream. I'll see you guys in a few minutes in there. Love you guys. And.